Is New York dying? The real reason behind the population decline. Did you know that New York, once the Empire State, is now shrinking faster than any other state in America? It's a surprising twist for one of the most iconic cities in the world. In this video, we'll explore the shocking reasons behind New York's rapid population decline. From high taxes and skyrocketing costs of living to shifting industries and changing work habits, New York's star has faded. But it's not just the obvious reasons driving people away, there's a deeper story, and we'll uncover it all. You'll want to stick around because there's one reason behind New York's decline that no one's talking about, and we'll reveal it later in the video. Trust me, you won't want to miss this. The Golden Age of New York For decades, New York symbolized opportunity. Whether you dreamed of working on Wall Street, becoming a Broadway star, or living the fast-paced life of the city that never sleeps, New York seemed to have it all. Its population surged through the 20th century with millions flocking to the state for a better life. But now, the tide has turned. In recent years New York has seen a dramatic reversal, losing hundreds of thousands of residents. The pandemic accelerated this trend, but the seeds of decline were planted long before. You may think it's all about the high cost of living, but there's more to this story than meets the eye. Stay tuned, because we'll touch on the hidden reasons behind New York's fall from grace soon. The High Cost of Living There's no denying that New York's cost of living is staggering. In New York City, the average rent for a one-bedroom apartment is nearly $3,000. And it's not just the city. High property taxes, expensive health care, and overall high costs are driving New Yorkers to more affordable states like Florida and Texas. People are fleeing for greener pastures, but did you know there's a more subtle force at play here? It's something nobody is talking about, but we'll reveal it later in this video. Taxes have always been high in New York, but recent increases have pushed many businesses and wealthy individuals to their breaking points. New York's tax burden is one of the highest in the nation, and it's not just affecting corporations, it's hitting middle-class families hard too. Big names like Goldman Sachs and J.P. Morgan Chase have started shifting operations to lower tax states, and the departure has been swift. However, most don't realize that another factor is causing this corporate retreat. The pandemic's impact. The COVID-19 pandemic played a huge role in accelerating New York's population loss. Suddenly, remote work became the new normal, and many realized they didn't need to be in the heart of Manhattan to keep their jobs. For the first time, people could live anywhere, and many chose to leave New York behind. The pandemic was just the tipping point. New York's population had already been dwindling for years, and while many blame the virus, there's another reason that's been quietly fueling the state's downfall. We'll get into that soon, so don't go anywhere. Political factors and social shifts. Beyond economics, politics have played a key role in New York's population decline. Many feel disillusioned with state leadership, citing poor governance, mismanaged budgets, and rising crime rates. These factors have led many to seek out states with more favorable political climates. But politics isn't the only thing driving this migration. There's a social shift happening under the surface, one that few are talking about. Stay with us and we'll explain this hidden dynamic shortly. The brain drain and youth flight. Younger generations are leaving New York in droves and that's a problem. The brain drain of educated, talented individuals is affecting New York's workforce and long-term economic stability. Many of these young professionals are heading to states with lower taxes, better job opportunities, and more affordable living conditions. The youth flight is real, but there's something even more disturbing about this trend that no one's discussing. The cultural and psychological shift. For years, New York City was a cultural mecca. People would dream of moving there to make it big. But recently, the city's charm has begun to wear off. Some say it's lost its vibrancy, while others cite safety concerns, rising inequality, and a loss of community spirit. But here's the kicker. There's a deeper psychological reason behind this cultural shift. It's something that's been quietly brewing, and we'll uncover it in just a moment. We've touched on the obvious reasons, taxes, high living costs, political issues, and the pandemic. But there's a more subtle, hidden force driving people out of New York, one that many overlook. New York's quality of life no longer matches its reputation. People are realizing that the dreams New York once offered are now more attainable elsewhere. Cities like Austin, Nashville, and Miami are becoming the new IT places. They offer vibrant job markets, lower costs, and a lifestyle that many find more appealing than the hustle and grind of New York. This shift in perception is reshaping America's urban landscape, and New York is struggling to keep up. In conclusion, New York's decline resulted from a perfect economic, political, and social storm. 
While the pandemic accelerated the process, it's clear that the state has been grappling with these challenges for years. The question is, whether New York can reinvent itself, or if it will continue to shrink in the face of modern pressures. If you found this video insightful, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to the channel for more in-depth documentaries just like this. Hit that notification bell so you never miss an upload and drop your thoughts in the comments below, we love hearing from you.